Got it back to his big. Over the top of Upshaw and Stony Brook. I knew immediately he'd be an immediate impact guy. He had great hands, he has great instincts. He's a great passer, great interior block passer. The would just camp. Nice feed inside. Broke every record in school history and blocked shots. And then he's one of the leading field goal percentage guys, you know, in the country. Even when he does have two or three guys on, sometimes he finishes those. It's all about improvement. Uh, I felt like I took a big step from my freshman year to my sophomore year to now my junior year. I just felt like the coaches, staff just put full confidence into me. Uh, the players around me put full confidence in me. And it was kind of just friendship, uh, togetherness, and just everybody believing in everybody. We know every night he's going to get double teamed, triple teamed. There's going to be guys all around him. So he does a great job of finding um, the open guy. He's a great piece for us because you know, um, he's a reliable big man. Um, no, those, those are kind of hard to find. Every team loads up to defend him. Um, he's seen every kind of defense possible, and he still rises above the scouting reports to give us great effort and give us great numbers and give us great leadership. My freshman year, I didn't have to worry about being the leader. My sophomore year, I didn't have to worry about being the leader. But now, since there's no seniors on the team, it's basically me and Trey team because we have the most experience on the team. We can just share knowledge to the younger guys and uh, how to win. Uh, how to like, take care of your body with this long season and uh, just to be ready every day. He's really taken uh, the baton and done a great, great job with a young team. We have no seniors this year in our program and a lot of newcomers and a lot of freshmen. He's done a good job leading them. We're hungry this year. Um, we've been disappointed a lot in, uh, in March and uh, we feel like we need to take that next step to be a good a college team to finally go to the tournament and uh, just keep getting better. Couldn't be more proud of him. He's got another year of development too. He really has a chance to have a special, special career, obviously at Stony Brook, but obviously for the next 10, 12 years after he leaves Stony Brook. And that's what I'm real proud of. Well, hopefully uh, after I graduate, I can either keep on playing basketball overseas or hopefully achieve my dream playing in the NBA.